Before we start, make sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Once you subscribe, don't forget to turn on notifications by clicking that bell icon so you won't miss any of my uploads. Let me know in the comments below if you subscribed and I might just reply to you. Now let's begin. Number 5. 10 year old dies while riding world's tallest water slide. In Kansas City earlier this year, 10 year old Caleb Thomas Schwab died in a shocking incident at the Schlitterbahn water park that led to the youngster sustaining a fatal neck injury. Witness reports told how the boy had mounted the 264 steps to board the Verrupt ride, which translates as insane in German, with two unrelated women. The ride, which was closed immediately after the incident, had its delayed debut in 2014 after failing numerous crash tests with sandbags simulating passengers. Despite this bad omen, safety nets were installed and the ride became fully operational and successfully so until Schwab's tragic death last summer. The boy was found dead at the bottom of a pool underneath the ride. He had been decapitated according to police reports. The park was closed immediately and is now under investigation. Reports suggest that Caleb Schwab's death was the result of human error and calls have been made to do more to prevent similar tragedies elsewhere. Number 4. Four Killed on Australia's Thunder River Rapids A shocking incident last October ended in tragedy for four visitors to Dreamworld, Australia's most popular theme park on Queensland's Gold Coast just outside Brisbane. Paramedics were quick to respond to calls when two of the victims became trapped inside the ride and the other two thrown from their raft, but attempts to save them were unsuccessful. The victims were two men and two women in their mid-30s and early 40s, according to news reports. The theme park held a private ceremony a few days after the incident for its staff, friends of the victims, and the emergency services and remained closed for a short period. An official at Dreamworld commented that the incident took place after a technical malfunction of the water rapids attraction, Thunder River Rapids, and that necessary repairs had been made to ensure no further incidents of this nature. Number 3. Waterworld Tragedy Back in the summer of 97, one 17-year-old lost his life while 32 of his peers were seriously injured in a waterslide tragedy that has gone down as one of the worst in theme park history. The class of 97 graduates were celebrating their passage from high school at California's hugely popular Waterworld theme park and couldn't wait to enjoy the waterslide attraction. Having eagerly crowded onto the water slide, the excess weight caused the ride to collapse, resulting in tragedy. One of the students was pronounced dead at the scene, and the others were instantly rushed to the hospital with injuries caused by the crush of the ride's superstructure. Seventeen of the students who had been involved in the accident that day went on to accept their diplomas in wheelchairs. The incident marked the first and only reported by local police and the only smudge on Waterworld's otherwise clean safety record. Number 2. Teenager plummets to her death on hydro roller coaster in Wales. Haley Williams had been visiting family in the area when she decided to visit the Oakwood theme park in Wales, United Kingdom. In a shocking incident that led to the park being exposed for not performing regular safety, the teenager, who died of internal injuries as a result of the fall from the hydro water roller coaster, had visited the well-known attraction alone. Oakwood Theme Park was found to be guilty of negligence when an independent report found that employees of the park had not been complying with safety procedures. The park's owners were fined £250,000 and ordered to pay compensation to the family of the victim. Number 1. Alpine slide death among many tragedies at world's most notorious water park. Despite being dubbed the safest ride there is, the Alpine slide at Action Park in New Jersey has gained a reputation for being one of the world's most dangerous ride there is. The first recorded death followed a malfunction of the ride that caused one of its sleds to derail from its cement track back in 1980. The victim was a 19-year-old male who had been thrown from his wheeled sled down onto the embankment where he sustained a fatal head injury on striking a rock. Despite the tragedy, the park remained open and the alpine slide continued to operate. 
Between 1984 and 1985, a whopping 14 fractures and 26 head injuries were reported to have been caused by the slide. The water park remains open despite its dubious reputation and continues to be a popular attraction in New Jersey.